Everybody, welcome back to the channel. This is Mystic Waters, and today we are playing Convenient What? A Convenient Who? A Convenient What? A Convenient Who? On episode Choose Your Story. While settling into your new life, Aubrey takes things to the next level. You're the next level. Let's go ahead and get into it. But before we do, before we do, remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share if you care. Yes, how y'all doing? Happy Monday. A happy Monday. Hey, a happy Monday. I can't believe we were talking about getting intimate just a few hours ago. <laughs> Getting down and sorry, okay. Down and sorry, girl. <laughs> and now I can't sleep. Oh Lord. Sometimes I wonder how important was it for someone to completely open up in a relationship. You got a lot to learn, Sky. You got a lot to learn. And in my defense, I had no experience at all. That's what I'm saying. You got a lot to learn, girl. You got a lot to learn. I wouldn't know if there was any limit, if there should be boundaries. Yeah, yeah, you gotta you gotta learn that stuff, Sky. And if there was any, what was the limit of those boundaries? You gotta ask questions, girl. Like, girl, I was clueless about all of these, but I'm willing to learn. We're gonna say, but I'm willing to learn, okay? I just need a teacher, teacher. I just need a teacher. I need fresh air. Sorry. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I wish I can learn a thing or two about love before actually getting married. You all. I still can't believe we get married to somebody we don't know. Must be nice to have gone through a lot of different heartbreaks before settling down. Maybe I'd be slightly less naive. I will say that. No, yeah, yeah. Maybe you would, Scott. Maybe you would. But guess what? Maybe I wouldn't be as naive as I am right now. But guess what? You're going through it now. The past is the past. We got to go through it now. Okay. Don't get me wrong. If I were given the chance, I definitely would have dated at least once. I know. I know, girl. I know. But your mama kept you sheltered, girl. Sheltered with bodyguards all the time. But when you had a bodyguard with you whenever you weren't at home, people just wouldn't come close to you. Exactly. That's something you couldn't fix. Girl. Also, the fact that I went to an all-girls school really didn't make it any easier. I bet it didn't. Uh, I bet it didn't. I bet it didn't. And now that I no longer have any bodyguards following me around, you all, I had a fiance. Yeah. One who I didn't love. I know. I know. It's crazy. I guess it's my fate to just go with whatever my parents have planned for me instead of writing my own story. That's so sad, you all. That's so sad. Falling in love? What's that? You'll find out, hopefully. Sky, what are you doing outside alone in the middle of the night? Aubrey, Aubrey, what you doing, boy? What happened to staying tucked under the blanket? I just, you know, just need to come outside and chill. You know what I'm saying? Think. Yeah, we just say I just needed some fresh air. Okay, just some fresh air. I'm sorry, I just need some fresh air. Okay, just some fresh air. Okay, I just needed it. I don't mean to be controlling, but don't you think it's dangerous? Oh my gosh. Like, seriously, Aubrey, uh, what if someone is out there waiting to kidnap or rob you? Then I'll rely on you to save me. Your writing won't happen again. Well, I'm still, I'm saying, well, I'm still alive, okay? I'm still alive. What you talking me? What you talking about? I'm still alive, okay? In my defense, oh wait, I know my defense, I've done a few dangerous things even before this. <laughs> I thought it was Aubrey talking. Like what? Like sneaking into the lone wolf? Remember? That's how we first met. I also dyed my hair pink when I was in high school. Then I helped my sister sneak out a few times. <laughs> well, she's just a natural badass, huh? <laughs> dangerous, dangerous stuff. <laughs> Can we just go home now? He's such a stick in the mud, okay? Okay, uh, Thank you. That's 
get inside the next day the next day y'all the next day what is happening sky can you help me talk to the delivery man i got you girl calm down why are you so i think he has the decorations what is happening it's a lot going on got it anything else It'd be nice if I could, uh, if you could help with the cashier after that, so I could do something else. I got you, girl. I got you. I got you, girl. Of course, of course. I'm so tired from all these preparations. I'm so ready to just go home. Oh yeah, they probably preparing for that thing. That thing, that thing. Only we still have four hours left. Oh. Thanks for reminding them, Sky. I'm just so thankful you joined the team. <laughs> All right, they would. Uh, can you imagine, Emma, if it was only us helping Alyssa? Oh, it would be a shit show. Uh, I'd rather not imagine it. Prepare. Are you sure this is your first job? It really doesn't look like it. <laughs> Just laughed off. I never said it was only because I have YouTube helping. I'm like only because I have YouTube helping me. <laughs> Good teamwork, you know. <laughs> you are the one who's helping us, not the other way around. I got you, girl. But it's teamwork. Teamwork make the dream work. But seriously, how is it only your first job? Ooh, is this our first job? It's because she's a B show and she's pretty, so people always expected more from her. I What's up, sister? She just popping in. Look at how cute is the Hi. I expected less from her. Same energy. Girl. Girl. <laughs> Deli, have you seen the dress that we're going to launch tomorrow? Ooh. She trying to change the subject. You want change it that movie. Ooh. Deli, don't say weird things, please. Oh. Oh, she bit her head off. What do you mean weird things? Like, girl, what you talking about? Why did they think this was your first job? I'm going to say it is my first real job, ain't it? Like, what did she do before? Was she wasn't working? Was she? Like, you are, I'm confused. Hold on now. Is this not her real job? Our first job? No, it's not. Oh, okay. Well, we need to figure it out. Does Aubrey at least know? No, I don't even know. Okay, I don't know what you're talking about. No, I never told him. You all. What's really going on? Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to eavesdrop at all. Oh, she pretty. Hi, pretty. She pretty. Ambrose. It's all right. We didn't know you were inside either. <laughs> is she a worker? Who is she? Or is she just like getting dressed? Wow, what was hot stuff doing here? <laughs> look at her. Huh, look at her. And bro, she's our model. <laughs> oh, so she's the model. Why didn't you tell me? Tell you what, girl? I would have come sooner if I knew. What are you talking about? What you talking about? What? Exactly. Like, what are you talking about? Oh, about the girl? Oh, Lord. <laughs> Thank you so much, everyone. I think we're ready for tomorrow. I hope so, because it sounded like we was about to tie you all. Dang. Sorry for making you work this late. I promise I'll compensate everyone nicely. Yeah, I bet you will, okay? I need some money. See you tomorrow. I'll see you tomorrow. Aubrey is sleeping in, in, in my office, by the way. Wait, why is he sleeping in your office? For what? He's here? Why didn't anyone tell me? Your. Your. He specifically requested me not to tell you. I don't know why. Aw, thanks, Allie. He's probably just waiting for me. How can you fall on a sleep and stuff? Oh, look at him. Well, he's actually asleep. <laughs> I'm done. Ooh, I can't believe he's been waiting for me the whole time. Like, literally the whole time. <laughs> Insane. His face looks so peaceful and serene right now. I felt bad for even thinking of waking him up. Wake him up, girl. <laughs> Should I wake him up? Wake him up with a kiss on the forehead. Yep, let's do that. With a kiss on the forehead. Hello, hello. Wakey, wakey, Aubrey. <laughs> you surprised me. Ooh. Were you awake the whole time? He probably was. Only when I heard you opening the door uh, and you decided to stay asleep. And, and you stayed asleep because 
I wanted to know what to, you would do. Okay. I'm saying, well, with Aubrey. Aubrey, no regrets. <laughs> Ugh, Aubrey. You're only mad because I caught you. Or you got caught. <laughs> you are naughty, naughty. I can't help, okay? Well, I think they meant I can't help it, okay? Of course, it's okay. Oh, it's okay. Oh, it's okay. Are you still sleepy? Like, do you want to go sleepy by? I am, but let's just go home now so I can continue sleeping. Go to sleep. Hey, go to sleep. Go to sleep. Hey, go to sleep. <laughs> Hopefully I won't crash the car. Uh, offer to drive him, okay? I can drive if you want. Does she know how to drive though, y'all? I don't know this guy know how to drive. Hold on. Tempting. Does she know? I have a driver's license, you know. Hey, yeah. Hey, okay, sure. Hey, yeah. Uh-oh. Look, she gave her that look. Is she driving crazy? Oh, Lord. Look, look at his face. Ah! Do you plan to kill us? <laughs> she that bad. I'm sorry. It's been a while since I last drove a car, right? Oh, Lord, she gonna kill us. <laughs> oh, Lord. You could have told me that before you offered. <laughs> Either way, we probably would have died. Okay, you was all sleepy and stuff. <laughs> but you would have said, only say no. <laughs> At this rate, it won't make a difference who drives. <laughs> You are. We'll still die anyway. You are. Aubrey, calm down, sir. Sir, don't be so dramatic, okay? Or have for, oh yeah, have more faith in me. No one will die. Have more faith in me, okay? Have more faith in me. <laughs> Look, he's on the couch. Aubrey, are you okay? Why are you sleeping here? Do you need one? Like, why are you sleeping here? Okay, why? Why are you sleeping here, sir? Are you mad at me? I still need to gather my soul after the stunt you just pulled. <laughs> oh, do you want me to ooh, massage and cook for you? Okay, let's see if we, he wants me to massage and cook for him. <laughs> Make him feel better. Make him feel better. Make him feel better. What do you mean, cook for me? You heard me, sir. Do you want it or not? Okay, I'm sitting here being nice. I don't know in case you're hungry. Like, hello. Hello. <laughs> I can at least make a sandwich. Ooh, a sandwich sound good right now. You want hey. Okay. Hmm. Do you want some food or not? Okay. Because I'll just eat it on my own. Okay. So, you want it or not? Can you massage me first? Oh, my God. Really, Aubrey? <laughs> Yes, of course. Let's rub a double double. Rub a double double. Eh, rub a double double. Eh, rub a double double. Wow. The good type of wow or the bad type of wow? Because there's two wows. Okay, there is two wows. Is there really a bad type of wow? Yes, there is. There is actually. <laughs> I don't know, just in case it is. Okay, I'm telling you guys right now, it is. It is the good type of wow. I didn't know you were such a talented masseuse. I'm a talented masseuse. Oh, it's a hidden talent, huh? It's a hidden talent. Better? Yes, it's better, better, much better. Huh? Thank you, Sky. Hey, thank you, Sky. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay, wait here and let me make you a sandwich. Oh my gosh, Aubrey, she's trying. I mean, Sky, she's trying. I called her Aubrey Lord. <laughs> she trying, yo. Okay, just gave it to him like by hand. Not bad. Not bad at all. What's so funny, sir? Okay. Do you want some? Give me some. I want some. I want some. I want sandwich. <laughs> Yo, um, yes. Sorry, y'all. I'm so over the top. Y'all would not be reading. Y'all are so over the top. <laughs> y'all love it, though. Ooh, sandwich, 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 sandwich. 
stop staring. Like, I know I look good in all all three. You don't have to stare, baby. I really want to kiss you right now. Oh, okay. Well, then kiss me. What's stopping you? Give me some kisses. Give me some kisses. Give me some kisses. Let him kiss you. Yeah, let him kiss me. Hey, what's stopping you? Hey, what's stopping you? Give me some kisses. Give me some kisses. I didn't know what went through my mind when I agreed, but I didn't mind this at all. Well, we are going to be soon to be husband and wife, okay? Being so close to him, kissing him. Are we really going to get married, y'all? It felt so nice and to some extent romantic. Like, I don't understand. Like, are we really going to get married? Like, is it really going to happen? If there was ever a moment when I really wanted the time to stop, it was right now. Stop getting you. you oh. Just so that we could crystallize the moment and enjoy it while it lasts. Oh, enjoy it while it lasts. Hey, that's the end of the chapter. Yeah, yeah. Let me know how down below how you feeling about this story. Convenient. It was episode seven. We got like what? It's fifteen chapters, so we got a few more to go. Y'all, let me know how y'all feeling about it, and what's the next story reading after this? It's a gym story. Let me know. Let me know. Let me know. But anyway, y'all. Thank you so much for watching. I truly appreciate it. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, share if you care, and I will catch y'all on another one.